Today we are learning more details about the five Marines who were killed in a helicopter crash last week. Such a devastating story. CBS 8's Alex Lai is outside MCAS Miramar with more information on the service members upcoming burial. Alex. A U.S. Marine escort was seen on State Route 163 right before 9 this morning. Now, a Marine official tells us that it was carrying the remains of the five Marines who were killed last week at the Pine Valley helicopter crash. Now, as you can see, a motorcade blocked off much of the road as they drove through five cars driving behind a truck and a number of motorcycles stopping traffic. They were going from Balboa Naval Medical Center to MCAS Miramar. We've been told the remains will now be transferred to Dover Air Force Base in Delaware, and there will be a private ceremony for the families. To recap the events on Wednesday, less than a week ago, a military helicopter crashed in Pine Valley during a training flight from Nevada to San Diego. Five Marines were on board and all five were killed in the crash. They were flying a CH-53E Super Stallion helicopter based out of Miramar. This flight was during California's strong winter storm, which brought heavy rain, wind and snow to Southern California. But right now, the investigation into the cause of the crash is still underway. And on Friday, the Marine Corps released the names of the fallen Marines. All of them were in their 20s and based here at MCAS Miramar. They are Lance Corporal Donovan Davis, Sergeant Alec Langan, Captain Benjamin Moulton, Captain Jack Casey, and Captain Miguel Neva. So again, we're told the remains of the Marines are now being transported to Dover Air Force Base in Delaware, where there will also be a private ceremony uh, for them to celebrate their life and honor them. At MCIS Miramar, Alex Lai, CBS 8.